The Canadians continue their push south on the Falaise Road, forcing the Germans to fall back towards Falaise, while the Polish 1st Armored Division guards the Canadians' western flank. Working in concert, the four nations combine to force the Germans into a narrow corridor, trapping them between the Americans to the south and the British, Canadian, and Polish armies to the north. For plan to work, cooperation must be perfect, like ballet. But soldiers are not dancers. So maybe we not wait. Maybe we go right after Richter, his tanks. We are closest. Close is dangerous. Richter has advantage in armor and supplies. So we cut Richter's supply line. For that, we rely on the British. All right. The Roche, Doyle, and Corporal Keith will take out the perimeter defenses and open the main gate. La Roche, Doyle, et Caporal Keith détruiront les bases allemandes du périmètre et ouvriront la voie de base. Once the gates open, we'll move in. Une fois que la voie est ouverte, nous nous déplacerons à l'intérieur. Two section will hold the entrance while one section destroys anything that looks remotely useful to Jerry. La section 2 bloquera l'entrée tandis que la section 1 détruira tout ce qui est utile au Bosch. And Keith, you make damn sure you get yourself past those bloody sentries as quickly as possible. My pleasure. Look after yourself with these onion eaters. Votre mère la syphilis, mon ami. Huh? Good luck to you two, Frenchy. Let's move out! Frenchy, move up.
Use the box, grab the cover! Okay, we're going to sniper fire from the hospital. Deckung gehen, Good show, boys. There's not enough time for me to plant all the charges. Tja, careful with these. They're already primed, understand? And then a few words. I like that. Why can't those veggies speak English? <laughs> 